Well, back to Falk Football, we've got some more daily transfer Scottish transfer news. Transfer Scottish transfer news, but Motherwell sign Blair Spittle after Ross County exit. He was one of the standout guys for Ross County last season, along with Charles Cook, um, the 26-year-old. I remember, I can't even remember what career mode it was, but I was taking this career mode with a team that, you know the team that bought Atto and, um, what's it, Roberto Carlos? And this was like 2013 or something. And I signed this guy, and he was like fucking 90 rated or something. Well, I got him up to 90 rated, I didn't sign him in 90 rated. But he's joined Motherwell on a two-year contract following his departure from Scottish Premiership Rivals Ross County. I think it's mad, this guy's 26. I remember this guy was around when, like, you know, when you were, you were seeing, like, Ryan Gold, Mackay Stevens, Robertson. Obviously, he just shows you these guys are getting on with age. But he spent three years with Dingwall after periods at Partick Thistle and Dundee United. He scored seven goals in 37 appearances last season. Um, and, uh, yeah, he says, well, he goes on to what, say what I said, and he displayed great versatility, as Graham Alexander has said. So that's a good sign in there from our big blur spittle, but in to the gossip column. Celtic and Arsenal have expressed informal interest in gent defender Joseph Okamamu. He first moved to the Belgian club from Ellsberg last season for three million, so interesting to see he'll be worth a lot more for that. But Dortmund were the first to make an official acquiry, so it looks like Arsenal, Celtic, Dortmund to battle it for him. Charlie Adam says he intends to uh, continue playing. Um, Vincent Company could fork Dundee's hopes of appointing Sean Maloney as their new manager, as the former Belgium centre was keen on appointing Sean Maloney as his assistant if he takes charge of relegate at Burnley after leading Andler. But would Sean Maloney want to play second fiddle again? I mean, he got a taste at Hibs, and albeit it was a very shit taste, it was like eating dog shit on the, the fucking side of the street. But that'll be interesting to see. Uh, Jamie McAllister could be moving for uh, to uh, Hibs. He was his right hand man. Si assistant boss, Bristol and Sunderland. Uh, I mean, it says here McGeady could potentially happen. We made a fit on that yesterday. Regan Charles Cook, that would be a good move for Hibs. Murray Davidson hasn't agreed a contract, but he, but he wants to stay. At uh, St. Johnson, Mary Davidson, Chris Burke announced he's a leaving promoter in such a new club. So Chris Burke is leaving. Kelly? Hearts are targeting as many as eight new signs from the start of next season with Chief Executive Andrew McKinney planning the move. Damn, it's mad. Uh, Aberdeen manager James Goodman said he's ineligible with offers of players from agents and revealed he is targeting experienced players aged between 24 and 28. It's good. I mean, that's a good tactic. Um, I, I've seen this. So, Billy Gilmore's brother, Harvey, got a contract with Kelly. One-year deal, and he looks nothing like Billy Gilmore. I think there's serious questions going to be asked there, guys. But, uh, yeah, Rangers forward Chris McKee has joined. Um, Linfield, undisclosed fee. Do we care? Not really. Um... You know, uh, well, not an awful lot happened. Here's the move there, move there. But, I mean, this is a bit intriguing about the coefficients. Roma's victory in the Conference League final has assured the Rangers of top seed at status uh, if they fail to qualify for the Champions League group stage and instead play in the Europa League sections next season. Well, they need to fear, guys, because the Rangers will be making the Champions League final. But anyway, that is it for your daily news. Also, Bassey, but I talked about Bassey on my channel. So, if you want to go see how you talk about Bassey, you go to my channel. But I, Leipzig, Fella, Frankfurt, all the boys, they want a wee bit of Bassey.